What is up guys, Blim here and we are back with more tournament gameplay coverage. Now in my channel you have seen a lot of hilarious stuff happening in tournament games. You have seen a blaster sweeping, you have seen a lot of hilarious chokes. However, today's game I have never ever ever seen anything like this before. This game is absolutely hilarious so yeah, this game is one of the best shits I've ever ever, ever seen in my life. So a quick introduction and then we'll cut straight to the chase. On the top we have Golden Warrior GW. They are a lower tier player mainly and they are also a very accomplished player as you can see by the custom Avi. And on the bottom also we have Ars9 who is one of the best players in this current tournament. Which is the best leaderboard tournament. They, are, they, have, they currently have one of the best records in the tournament so this game is absolutely, I mean, a game between two very very accomplished players. And this game is a... Not an OU game as you can see by the preview, this is a real used game, however that doesn't make this game any less. Just watch what happens in this game, So this shit is so hilarious. So let's cut, cut straight to the chase now. We see a registry lead on an incinerator lead. Now whenever you see, you will see like registry on, on incinerator, obviously the registry will switch out because it's incinerator, it can be anything. It can be offensive, it can be defensive, but regardless this incinerator can go for a knockoff, it can go for a flare blitz which is gonna do a lot of damage and this registry might potentially die. So yeah, the registry should switch out, but let's see. Incineroar switches out to the Toad, they don't go for the Flare Blitz, Body Press comes out, okay, I think they predicted the Body Press. I mean, yeah, that's why they switched out, because this Incineroar, it might be a defensive Incineroar, so it Flare Blitz wouldn't do much, and Body Press would have done a lot of damage to the Incineroar, that's why they switched out, but however, this registry switch out now. Steel type on a ground type, nope, they go for the block, okay, they go for the block, but you want a steel type on a ground type. Goes for the knockoff on, on, Iron Defense, okay, Iron Defense. You have earth power, surely have earth power, earthquake, oh shit shit shit, goes for the iron defense again, okay, now earthquake hoping to crit but it doesn't do much, body press does a shit ton of damage, oh my god is it gonna crit, no crit doesn't come out, you surely have rest right, okay goes for the id again, surely this rest does rest, or else no point it goes for the iron defense again, oh yeah the rest comes out and this toad is absolutely screwed right now, let me tell you, this toad has to crit earthquake 3 times or else this toad is super duper screwed. Oh my god, are we gonna see a huge upset? Goes for the earthquake, hoping to crit, doesn't do much, only 10%, burns 1 turn of sleep. Goes for the earthquake again, doesn't crit, 10% again, 1 turn of sleep burn, 2 turns of sleep burn. Goes for the earthquake, doesn't crit again, and goes for the body press, nails the toad. Oh my god, the guardian versus should trick, trick or focus flex, focus blast. No, they switch it to the crowbat. Okay, crowbat is 4x resisted. So this body press did only 42%. However, if this crowbat goes for the roost, the 4x resistance it will change into 2x because it will convert to a flying type from a poison flying type. So this body press will do an enormous amount of damage if this crowbat goes for the roost. So the crowbat cannot go for the roost. Let's see what happens. The crowbat goes for the U-turn to the what? Gardevoir 4x resisted. One more one 4x resisted. Body press does 54%. What is this Gardevoir gonna do? Okay, tricks. Body press kills the Gardevoir. However, this registry is now super fast. It has got a choice scarf. <laughs> Look at the remaining ones. Oh my god, I can already see it coming. Goes for the roost as I said, 4x to 2x. Now this body press does 79% damage. Absolutely hilarious, Brave Bird doesn't do anything. Body press kills the crowbat and now this race is super fast. Goes for the body press on the beer. The beer takes 64. This beer goes for the soul's chest but it's too late because the registry is super duper fast. I think we should have gone to the beer long time ago, long long time ago. Registry outspeeds and kills the beer and the remaining two slow mons Incinerator comes out Body press sends the Incinerator straight to heaven and this registry is gonna be sent to hell Absolutely hilarious Have we ever seen shit like this? Top level tournament high stake match Lead up with the registry and sweep the whole team from the get go Never ever seen anything like this registry is, is not even that good of a mon It's, it's just set up, set up rocks Toxic protect all that stuff, but this shit, this shit was next level. Let's watch that sweep sequence again. So this resilience burn two tons of sleep, and let's watch the sweep sequence. <clears throat> Earthquake doesn't do much. Body press, toad gone. GG. Gardevoir comes out. However, they decided not to trick and go to the crowbat, and crowbat destroyed. The U turn go to the Gardevoir again. Gardevoir <laughs> took over 50 percent from a four instant move. On stab goes for the trick. Now this race still is super duper fast. As I said, Crobat, if it roosts, it's gonna take 2x damage over 4x resistance. Gone. <laughs> Brave Bird doesn't even do doesn't even do any damage. 
Go on, Crobat, go on now. That three slow one comes out. Beware. <laughs> Soul Dance comes out, but it's way, way too late. And this body press is gonna send it straight to Mars. Then the Incineroar comes out. The Registeel sends it straight to hell. And the last Registeel is gonna come out. Yeah, it comes out. And one more one sent to hell. And this is why their name is Ars9 because he likes kicking everyone's asses. Golden Warrior, they suddenly, suddenly got their ass kicked here. So yeah, this should be it for today. But hold on, if you guys are thinking this is a scripted game, let me show you that as well for all the misconceptions out there. So as you can see, this is the Pokemon Showdown, the best leaderboard tournament, and this is the final week. And this is a game between uh, his, uh, where is Ars9, 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 yeah. This is a game between, as you see, GW, Golden Warrior versus the Franklin, and the Franklin, his name is Ars9. So yeah, this is a deciding game as well. Whoever wins this game, their team moves on to top seed. And so for more amazing, genuine tournament coverage, make sure to subscribe to the channel, leave a like and stay safe, take care, peace.